Hey guys, Mr. Freddy here. Today is going to be uh, another reaction video, and this time it's uh, sub downs besides YTPs and SMG4s stuff. Which this one is a something analog horror FNAF video, which is called Voice Box uh, Maidens, which made by which is made by Foxy Fox. It came out eight, which came out like a month ago. It has eighty three thousand views, and the thumbnail features a. Uh, a slightly revamped version of Toy Chica, possibly made for this video. So, yeah, let's see what these, uh, what this, what spooky stuff this video is gonna have. So here we are in three, two, one, go. Oh, oh, it's it's All right. Well, I finally made it to Freddy's, even though traffic kept me from arriving a bit more later than usual. I at least made it. <sighs> Okay, first thing I should do is get the stage lights going. That might be a problem, however, since I don't know this control box way too well. Uh, glad they labeled the buttons, though, so should be this one? There you go. Okay, well, the boss told me that she can need to be seen tonight, especially since her voice seemed a bit more jumpy than usual on today's performance. Now, even though I don't work the day shift, a few co-workers told me about what had happened, and uh, it was uh, it was something. So the boss called me up to run a voice maintenance on her, just to make sure that everything is okay. Oh, and before I forget, I'm going to be recording myself doing this, just to show my boss that I've actually been doing the work and not slack off. Like the other times, he's caught me. Uh, we don't talk about that. I'll just go okay, take, um, this take place before you shoot, which so button is it? This is time I'm going to have to. So this one? This one doesn't work at this place yet. I guess so. Okay. Hi, everybody! Hi, Chica! <laughs> Let's party! Huh. Huh, it didn't sound bad at all. It honestly it just sounded like normal. I don't know what the boss could be on yes. about. Very Unless I try target. another voice test, maybe it'll start showing the glitches, but as of right now, I'm not hearing anything too bad. Right. Aha! Uh -huh. There you go. Okay, well, now I guess it's my job to fix her. So, let me go get the toolbox from the storage room and I'll be right back. Well, there is some good news and some bad news. Huh. The good news is, after removing part of Chica's beak and taking a closer look at the endoskeleton, nothing seems to be wrong with their mechanics. The bad news is, mm -hmm. it's probably going to mean a change of a voice box, and I didn't bring that out from the storage room. Uh -huh. So now I have to go get the box from the storage room and come back. Again. Like all these like, uh, one dude who's like giving instructions on how to fix it from. Oh, 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 oh. Switch the marionette. Okay, so hopefully now that I switch out the voice box for a newer one, it mm. should fix the problem. However, I realized something, and I'll have to check back the recordings after this. But when I had arrived back from the storage room, the puppet animatronic or whatever that thing is, is not on stage anymore. Mm. But then again, the box is closed. Probably just has a timer set to it to open and close it, so it's nothing I should worry about. Anyways, uh, let's see if this works out. Wow, that actually sounded way more better than before. Huh. No, because of me. <laughs> okay, well, uh, I think that's everything the boss wanted me to do, so I think it's time I should start closing up for today.
sir. What are you doing? Can't you keep it on? Okay. The bird is over here, kid. Did I have to do turn her on again? Which one is it to turn her on? So many buttons on this. Uh -oh. oh, great. Uh -oh. Now I accidentally turned the lights off instead of <coughs> turning car off. Oh, boy. Uh, give me a minute. I have something here. All right. Okay. Now, which one is it to turn the lights on? Uh, yeah, look at that. They're next to each other. Okay. Why don't you turn it on? Well, it looks like something short-circuited the power. And now I have to go into the breaker room and fix it. At least that thing is finally turned off. Uh, oh, no. Yes, okay. So, I managed to get the power back up running. So, everything should be A-OK. -okay, and I'm finally able to leave. <laughs> oh, no. What the? Oh, no. What the hell? It must be on the other side. What the hell could it be, though? Unless this is a. Oh, what's that? Okay, oh, okay, oh, oh, it's, it's a puppet thing. It's a, it's a marionette. <laughs> what the hell was that? It's a puppet. <laughs> I'm getting out of here. What the? What the hell did I just hit? <sighs> Okay, <laughs> that freaking got me. So good. That freaking got me. So, yeah, that was pretty terrifying, though. Especially the. It just felt pretty quiet, besides, you know, the, the dude is pretty much instruction. It felt like, like the, the dude who felt like a, like a instruction guy to for new employees to have to repair animatronic, especially had to swap out voice boxes. But goddamn, that ending is pretty terrifying, you know, especially the freaking the marionette just shows up and that uh, toy chicken jump scare. Also, a bit, a bit scarier than the in FNAF 2, you know. But yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this video, guys, and uh, like and comment this video and subscribe for more content. So this is Mr. Better here, and I'm out of here.